Manatu lea wa ta to tu la tai le si ui o fai ngā mea a wā le fa moe moe o le so. Mā lō le la pa pali, fa fitai le ono sai. O upo le fai salamu, o le fa moe moe wa tau nu, o le la au le so i fua lea. I le awa ma le mi ngā o tele, o te tu la i atu ai, le fai alo fa tau waa. Mā fa fonga anga o la mā tau tau sanga fai waso. Tau sanga sku tolu, lua felu tolu. E tau ma whai atu ai se upol fa fitai, fa ma lo ma le whala e au. A e au ina o fa apoi ma u fa tu nou. I le pa ia ma walunga wa si sao ni. I na ne i la anoa se tala, o na whai lea ma lape o le tau talanga. Ua pa ia ma ma malu le mea nei, a wao lo o fio fa anilu lilo ai lea ma ngao lea tua. Ua maua luma fo i le aso, a waa wa aatoa sa moa i le la moa nei. O sa moa, o le atu nuu wa umo na tofi, ma i o na ao se i a o o i o na inu. Ua maa e ao na pae pae o le whanua lo ta atoa ta e ao, i pa ia ma sa o le atu nuu, le maa lo, ma le tala le le, e le e wa whai ma fufonga o le aso. O le a le atoa e o o la e ai se uku, a waa o pa ia wa ta otu, Ai o se ala o o. Ai o le a fanga tonu le malama, ma vili tonu le ife maaina, i le au maolo tiu lai. O le a so, ua tatoa moli ma uina ai le fai unga, o lo mātou o la oa o ina i te tonu le lau mone i, le kolisio sa moa. Ma o te fia whanga ai na ai le nei awa noa whaa aua, e whaa leo ma moli moli atu ai, lo mātou o ngango le whaa pitai ma le whaa balo. Mua mua, e maua lunga le whaa whetai o le whaa manu ma le whaa ni tama i le tapa au sili o i le langi. Ona o le lasi ma le ano ano a e o na mea lofa, ma ana whaa manu iama, mo i mātou le whaa nau. E whaa whetai le poto, le ola ma le maa nosi. Ana le se anoa le a mama o le atua na tau to anoa ina i mātou. Ua o se fo e lava e whaa e le tau, a mātou ta ma whainga. Lua, O te via whawhetai a fo'i mai le ta ele o lo uwhatu, lau sunga te mai tai pule, le pulenga, ma le wasenga o whai a oma. I loa o tau so i fua ma lunue, i le awa au ino i mātou le whanau. Fa ma loa whawhetai le lama papale, ma le ono sa ia o mātou winga ma fo linga e se e se, i le aso ma le aso. O le mea moni, ua o tau ngā wha atia, la a ina ma timu ia. Ono lo o tō sila sila i se luma na i le lei mo i mā tō le whānau. Fa whetai o o tō tō mai, ua sa saa ma fa so mai. Ai mai se o la o tō fa amalo si au, ma upu a poa poa i, e fa tō no fulau ai no mā tō bola. Fa ma amalo ni mā tō se se, ma so mā tō vai vai, ai mai se no mā tō fa alo ni tā i le te leo tai mi. Tōlu, E whaapitu au ngawhasi whaapitai mā tua, a inga wō mai e mā sani. Whaapitai tēnei lō o tō titi whaitama, a e mai se o lā o tō titalu, ma le whaamanu hia i le ao ma le pō. Whaapitai le moni o lō o tō wa lō lofa, ma upu whaala e au i le tēle o taimi mā tō te whaapai wai ai. Ma le waaenga muli muli, e le whae titi ai lō na tāua. Tama ma teini o le polisio sa moa. Mā loa whawhitai le tau wiwi, ma le whi nau i le nei tau sanga. E le i whai ngon whia lau tātou sa valinga, e te le lu i tau ma whao so songa ni tātou whitai a i le ala. A e whawhitai loa o tau wa nga nga whitu whaai, ma le whilango langa mai, ua tātou tau nu uai si tau nu unga manuia i le whai unga o le nei tau sanga. Ia sanga whatu ma ui na le o la whi nga ma le tau wiwi, i na ia tū ma ti e pea si o tātou a lawa, a ta mai e tau tua mo sa moa. E fa ma lulu atu le au fia, o na o le ma tau atu o lo fino mia ni tātou ma whatama. O le ala le o le a fa mai atu ai se uku i le ngangana peritania. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, teachers and fellow students, amongst our gathering today we have non-Samoan speakers, hence with all due respect, 
I wish to deliver the rest of my speech in English, if I may. My humblest apologies for doing so. Today marks the conclusion of four remarkable years at Sanwa College. Years filled with mirth and memorable experiences, as well as tears and a hefty dose of stress, especially during school exams. This year has been the most eventful year yet since we have set foot on the grounds of this prestigious college. And we, the class of 2023, are fortunate to have been a part of this year's festivities, especially being the exiting class that commemorated Samoa College's 70th anniversary since its establishment in 1953. The past four years have been arduous, but gratifying. We have acquired a plethora of knowledge and skills from lessons taught both within and outside of the classroom, all of which have helped our growth into the individuals you witness today. It goes without saying that none of this would have been possible without the grace and favour of our Heavenly Father, not to mention the help and support of our parents, families and friends, as well as our principal, our vice principal and our teachers. And so on behalf of my fellow Year 13 pupils, I thank you all. First and foremost, we give thanks to God for his provision and guidance throughout this academic year and for bringing us together today to celebrate our accomplishments. Thank you to our parents, families and friends for your prayers, well wishes and unwavering support that has carried us from the very beginning. Thank you to our principal, Ms. Karene Fasila, for teaching us that anything can be achieved through hard work and with the right attitude. I would also like to thank our teachers, firstly, for enlightening us with what we know today, and secondly, for your patience. Thank you for putting up with crummy attitudes, last minute assignments, and probably a century's worth of whining and complaining. We are grateful for and acknowledge the hard work and the effort that you put in to ensure our proper education. And we can only hope that we have repaid you through our achievements this year. I stand before you today as a representative of the class of 2023, the class that entered the college the same year that COVID-19 reached Samoa. And just like the many variants of the coronavirus, so is the diversity of students in this dear class of mine. Varying from timid students to outgoing students, to students who love and enjoy detention, and students who are not afraid to test the patience of prefects and teachers. <laughs> students who love to read, and students who enjoy sports. Students who relish a good laugh, a good song, and audacious dance moves. Collectively, all these students have had the pleasure of being told off by Ms. Fasila, Ms. Robina, and Mr. Tuwala. Safe to say, we have earned the title of being the best year 13 class yet. With all that said in general, on a more personal note, I would like to take this opportunity to express my sincere gratitude and appreciation to a number of people that have contributed to my being here today. Again, I would like to acknowledge the love and grace of God, as if it were not for Him, none of this would have been possible. I now turn to thank my parents and my family, the people from whom I received my life's blood. Thank you for providing me with everything that I needed during my time here at Samuel College. Offering wisdom, encouragement, prayers, and patience. I also thank my siblings, Namanyane and Mernika Enosa, for your reassurance and selflessness. You have truly been a blessing over the past four years. Thank you to all my extended family members, my grandmother, Jackie Fasila, my mama, Nini, my late pa, Lolo Fietere, Saudi my Dr. Eti Enosa, my late Ma, Susana Enosa, as well as my late great-grandmother, Famini Fasila, whom have all passed from this life, my aunts, uncles, and cousins. Thank you for the support that you've given me, which has served as a great source of comfort during turbulent times. 
I would also like to give a special mention to my spiritual parents, Reverend Alda Tavita Anisone and Falitua Dale Lupe Anisone. I thank you from the bottom of my heart for the spiritual guidance from my birth until your recent retirement. Also a special note of thanks to my current spiritual parents, Reverend Faisiota Autangavaya and Falitua Lilie Autangavaya. Thank you for your prayers and blessings. I would like to thank our principal, Ms. Basila, a force of nature that has always pushed me to put my best foot forward in all that I do, and reminding me that when things do not go your way, you'll simply have to build a bridge and get over it. <laughs> I pay tribute to all my teachers. Thank you for teaching me all that I know, for tolerating childish behavior, silly questions, and a whole lot of chattering. My apologies to you all if there were times when I did not meet expectations or did not make your task of teaching any easier. I also acknowledge the efforts of my tutors, Reverend Moa Famasua and Ms. Filioata Murtalu, which have oiled the wheels of my understanding. Thank you for taking the time to teach and assist our students with studies, assignments, and so much more. Last but not least, I thank my friends and my class of 2023 for making this college experience everything that it is. Blissful, memorable, extremely stressful, and wonderful in its entirety. Reprimands, praise, suspensions, detentions, and so much more, we've been through it all together. And with certainty, I say I would not have had it any other way. As we end this chapter of our academic life and start anew, I, cu I encourage you all to keep your nose to the grindstone as hard work trumps talent when talent does not work hard. Through knowledge to achievement, that is the motto we live by. To the younger classes that we'll be leaving behind, dare to strike out and find new ground. No, I'm not saying you should stir mischief and dispute that could earn you a premature farewell to the school. I'm saying that the school has so much to offer and you, you need only to seize the opportunities that it provides. Be consistent with your work and you will be rewarded. I leave you with three important lessons that I've learned as a student here at Samuel College. One, asking for or accepting help from others is not a sign of weakness. When it comes to your growth and development, you'll find that most times your pride will have to take a back seat. Do not be boastful, but be kind to your fellow classmates and be willing to lend a helping hand. Most importantly, trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. Two, chance favors the prepared mind. This is a saying that my dad would often quote as I prepared for exams. I took it lightly at first, but only came to realize the heavy truth to it when I was a senior. You can never expect good results if you do not put in the work. Finally, the most important takeaway from my four years experience. Steer clear of Miss Basila's office. Before you do before you do any questionable deed, ask yourself, will I get sent to Miss Basila's office if I do this? If the answer is yes, then don't do it. If the answer is maybe, you don't want to risk it. If you fool yourself into thinking, she'll never find out, like, I'm telling you now, she will. <laughs> I now would like to end my speech by asking each and every one of you, my family, my teachers, my fellow pupils, for your pardon. Pardon me if ever I did anything to upset you or disappoint you, as a daughter, a student, or as a friend. Pardon me if at times I was not able to meet expectations in fulfilling my duties as head girl. Above all, pardon me if ever I did anything to hurt you, whether it be a cruel comment, an immoral act, or even if I hurt you in your dreams. Please accept my sincerest apologies for my shortcomings. I wish only the best for everyone here today. And now that all has been said and done on my end, I thank you for this golden opportunity 
and wish you all a very Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year.